And we got number 32 playing center for Minnesota. You know, he the 14 points in the fourth quarter were tremendous. The way that the diversity of talents that Carl Anthony Towns has, the pass to Jaden McDaniels charts. Anthony Edwards able to get one to rattle in. That's a nice start yeah. for Ant, who get, really didn't see a drop last in last night's game. Getting him off the move, too, and, and don't let the defense just stay set. Coming off staggered screens like that, it's a good action for him. Kevin Porter Jr. gets that to go. He's been playing the point guard position. To an enigma a little bit, both in college and here at this level at the NBA. He's part of the reason why they were okay with getting Victor Oladipo traded as Carl Anthony Towns drills to three to do going yeah, forward. They're, they're playing him at the one, and you know, and he's been flourishing at the one too. So shot ready. Boy, that was fantastic. Kelly Olynyk fires up at three, and how about this start for both teams? <laughs> Nobody's missed a yeah. shot yet. Had 15 assists and 14 points last night, and he mm. is able to get a bucket here. Certainly was moving as he was trying to knock Ricky off. They're coming strong against Cat now, and, and what a pass. Did a great job when you watch Cat Day. Order. Dumps it underneath, Ooh. and McDaniels with a block, then able to save the basketball. So good. Edwards gets it ahead to Rubio. Ricky will try the three, and the Timberwolves are three of four from downtown to start this game. Porter, mm. and Porter's going to get a chance to go to the line. He actually went off on them, and I didn't disagree with it as... Anthony Edwards gets a nice lay-in. What a beautiful cut and feed by Rubio. Wall. And the Timberwolves come up with yet another turnover. Towns for Beasley. And Beasley, his first points since February. Punch in his game has been evident, and it's also been evident here in Minnesota with Malik Beasley. By the way, that graphic we showed you, Christian Wood would have been on it had he qualified. He, he missed too many games. Linick with a rebound. The Rockets looking to go in front. Rubio needs to either improve his angle to be able to pass it into Towns as Linick knocks down another shot here. In the game, and all of a sudden, he's just producing. 8 nothing run now for Houston to go back in front. McDaniels able to not wow. uh, get it back to a one-point game. Mm. John Wall, no. Anthony Edwards, yes! He was running full speed and Ant could have caught him. Oh, how about J-Mac? Wow, so Talk about speed right there. He turned on the Jets mm. and Towns gets a dunk as a result of it. Um, he was asked how he felt Jordan McLaughlin played and he just was glowing about all the things that J-Mac did. John Wall works his way inside. Rookie, even more so. Yeah, no doubt. Jaden McDaniels has really been found wow. uh, a, a, a diamond in the rough. Meantime, mm. they work it outside of McLemore. Ben McLemore, man, he had a heck of a game last night for Houston. 13 to two, the run here, and the basketball taken away. Wilson gives it up. Oh, what a beautiful feed there by Wilson. Rockets did outshoot the Timberwolves in the game last night, and Porter pushes the advantage to 14. Show it at this level, really. I mean, I think playing him at the one is important. Wow, there we go, JC. Four seconds. Porter able to connect. Porter able to get a finish. Uh, how about that body control. Augustine blocked by Towns, but right into the hands of Wilson. And he's got a chance for an and one. If it's like gone out of fashion, if it's not something that's a thing anymore in the NBA where people box out, but. Beasley able to find Towns for the flush. When you're down like this, you have to do all these little things. And this is how you get down like this is when you don't do the fundamentals. Augustine, no. Wilson able to work the offensive glass and the second chance buck. Meantime, somebody needs to attack offensively for the Wolves. Anthony Edwards trying to answer that call. Ant connects on the three ball. Mm. That was a nice bounce pass on the entry by John Wall to set up Tate. 
Shot clock getting low, and it doesn't That's matter. Ridiculous. Sterling Brown able to get it to go. Just not a lot of side-to-side -side ball movement, you know? I mean, the Wolves have not been making Houston work at all. Olenek underneath, Porter, and the Houston Rockets right now running the Timberwolves out of their own gym. McDaniel sits a corner three. The journey of a thousand miles. Rubio quickly up the court, Jalen Noel. And Jalen hits one to close out a corner. There you go. Hallelujah. <laughs> Third foul of the game on Towns. Porter rattles home a three. And the Rockets lead now is 31. And they just are packing the paints so much. Wall for Porter. Mm. How easy is it for Houston right now? It is sort of making an adjustment here so they can switch all this action. Tate underneath. But Malik gets rolled up and dropped off. Rubio. Anthony Edwards and Ant drills a triple. You know what I'm saying. I'm saying at this point we're down 30. Yep. And the Rockets continue to just pour it on here. Tim Rolls last night came back from 19 down in the third quarter to win. And tonight, not going to happen if they keep missing shots, yeah. though. Wow. Wolves are a good four. save there. There really was. Rubio, no. Towns! Oh, yeah. Well, there's something to get excited about. In that regard, Dave, in terms of the defensive rebounds, they're just not grabbing them. Beasley, there you go. Malik yeah. finally able to hit a three. They need to get over in that left corner. Shot clock getting low. Cat spins, fires, and Cat finishes. Oh, that was sick. The three-point shot and then to back down D.J. Wilson and just throw it off the glass so nonchalantly. McLemore steps back and connects on a three. Towns will fire the triple and connect. Cat with his second three. He's got 21 in the game. Towns attacking, trying to pass it out. Wancho for the three. Wancho connects. There you go, Wancho. J Mac got a hand on it. McLemore, no. Tim Rolls get the basketball. McLaughlin for Noel. It's at 18. Scored on 10 of 11 possessions. Augustine. Tate rattles it home. How about that shot? They, they do a good job. Aaron Gomez. And Wancho, it's back to an 18-point game. It's a 25 to 9 run by the Wolves. Mm. Augustine. Too easy. Augustine. Rockets have a game this year where they shot 54%. Timberwolves cannot afford any no. empty trips. No. Uh, they get the miss, and then they give up the offensive board. And the dunk, and a chance for an and one. How often have we seen Minnesota swing the basketball from side to side? And it's it's okay to even do it twice, Dave. There's no rule against it. Shot clock down to five. Augustine finds mm. K.J. Martin underneath. And has, you know, especially the anger issues, and if the and John is an expert in substance abuse, and not that... Kevin Porter Jr. has had any of that, but Lucas took care of me and, and was one of the guys that helped me sort of acclimate myself to the league. Helped me and, and, and picked me up when I was down. Former Timberwolves coach Don Zierden's son, Isaiah Zierden, who played at Benild with my son. Well, and Justin Patton, Jimmy, he throws down a dunk. Yeah. You know, I, and I don't know if this is lip service that he said when he got here. Defensive shooting percentage, what they allowed the Rockets to do, especially in that first half.